If you're looking to buy FIFA coins, then do head over to fifacoinshop.com. Links in the description. So nice and cheap coins for both PlayStation and Xbox. And I hope you enjoy the video, guys. Hey guys, BHD here, and today we've got episode two of Monopoly FIFA. This week we're doing it with the France squad. So the first roll of the dice, we do land on the blue, which um, means I get to bring in a bronze player. So I've spent 200 coins as an average player. Really, really black, as you can see. But um, so that was the first roll. The next roll, we do get a four, five, six, seven. So we managed to get a chance, which means we get to open a pack. So we open this gold pack and hope for the best. So uh, hopefully, I do get something good. And um, as we do, we get the thing that we got Park, the striker. I think that's his name. Yeah. The Korean, he's the one that we put into a squad out of these three players simply because he manages to link up out of everyone with one player and the other two don't manage to link up in the end so I had to think about what I was doing with them. The other pack is um, a little messed up. I opened a silver and a bronze but it didn't record the bronze pack and I ended up using the bronze player from that pack so that's why you don't see him until I add him into the squad, that's the reason for that. Also guys, last episode of this is on 116 likes, please can we get this to over 50 likes again, you can see you really enjoyed it, and I quite enjoy making it as well. So um, there you can see Park being added in, I'm not allowed to change his formation or any positions and stuff like that. So it's not too bad with 77 pace and 76 shot, I think that just was. Um, and we also got to advance all the way to, I think that's, I'm not going to guess what that says, I can't see on my screen. But it's the very, very last one, which means I'm allowed an 85 rated player up to 99 rated. So for a French, the, I think the highest I could get was either Ribéry or Benzema. I chose Benzema, so the 87, and he also links up with the striker because they're both in the league of BBVA. 85 pace, 83 shooting, 76 heading, and 84 dribbling. Have done a review on his inform in the past. Um, the next roll of the dice was, I think. We land on another pack, I'm not sure, we'll see now. Land on the community chest, yep, there we go. So this is where I'm supposed to record it, both the silver and the bronze, because it's the second time we've landed on it. But only the silver seem to record, so that's why I've been through that. Um, this episode, guys, isn't as probably filled with goals at the end as last one, because the team was horrible to play with in the end, I'm not going to lie. So uh, that's the reason for not a lot of goals. I'm also interested to know, are you fine with a layout like this? Lots of people commented last time it's a good idea and things like that. Are you happy to just have goals at the end with a score of this squad or do you want them in a particular kind of layout? So let me know that in the comments as well after you've of course liked it to get this over 50 likes if you enjoyed it. So um, here's the bronze player that we had in. He was in the 5-3-2 formation. There he is. Stick him in, he was fairly average. Um, you probably have to see now, it's probably say first owner. Yeah, it did very quickly. I moved on 69 pace. Whoa, well, hey. Uh, the rest of his stats are really, really average, to be honest with you. Only poor shooting and things like that. Not even his passing was that good, to be honest with you. So we roll again. We get a nice six, and what do we move on to? Move on to. The reds, um, so that means I'm allowed in a 70 rated, 74 rated, so we pick up him for 1.8k. In 442, that's why it's a little bit more expensive, and he's fairly average stats, but that's probably the best you could get for French centre midfielders at the time. Next we've got a 7, so I can move on all the way to another bronze rated player. I think it was the left back that we pick. no, we picked the right back. Um, so he slots in nicely there, that's an orange link up on um, 200 coins is all he was, 63 pace, the rest of his stats 58 defending, not the best. And next of all we, the roll of the dice, I can't remember off the top of my head what we move on to next, but it's not too bad I don't think. We get a yellow, which of course means that I'm allowed a fairly decent player, so um, I think that's rated 75. 5 to 79. So we go over the left midfielder. I do pick up Enzogbia, the Aston Villa left midfielder. Aston Villa? Aston Villa. Um, four star skill moves, two star weak foot. 1.3k. I probably overspent somehow there, but 90 pace was all I was looking for in the end. Then, next of all, the roll of the dice. We managed to get. Dun dun dun. 
another pink. So we go to bronze, the left bat now, we managed to stick him in. So um, that's pretty much it. You can see the squad's looking a bit a bit different. Hopefully you enjoy this type of squad builder type thing. I thought it was a pretty decent idea when I was trying to think of stuff. This week's isn't as good and I will remember for next episode, which hopefully... Um, let me know if you want two of these a week. I, I can possibly do two of these a week if you want me to. But um, next week I'll try and... or next episode, I'll try and leave it out. Average it out. You can see I've spent the four goal players that I've got have all been up front, so both right mids and strikers. I'll try and average it out so we have one keeper, one defender, one midfielder, and one striker, just so it's leveled and nice and equal and doesn't look boring. And it's also really hard to play with when it's really poor defenders. So we see there we land on that and we managed to get a, I think it's a silver centre back. Yeah, we do. Colin, um, the big white beast. It was a pretty beasty when I was using him. 1.2k is what I paid. 63 pace, 80 heading, that's not bad, and 70 defending. Then the final player I got to choose, because that's how we do it, which is the 11th player, so I got to choose the goalkeeper to fit him in there. 65 rated overall. Um, and that's pretty much the full squad. You see some goals now. Pretty much all of these were scored with Benzema, or Benzema, whatever of those two it is. That was the first goal. That wasn't too bad to be honest with it. The first game I played a 86 rated squad and we did manage to beat this team. I think it was 4-1 in the end. But um, after this game it just went disastrously wrong. I went two games and lost. I didn't score a goal in those two games. And then the next two games I think I won and drew. But I did manage to score many, of these, many goals of this squad because it was just really, really hard to do so. Only Benzema and seemed to score. But... Um, Park managed to get a nice goal here, we weaves in and out of the defenders, so that wasn't too bad either, I think Park might get another one a little later on, as alongside Benzema. So um, that's pretty much it for this episode of FIFA Monopoly, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, remember to leave a like, 50 likes would be great, leave a comment on the couple of questions I asked, which I think were, do you want two of these a week? And also, there was another question, what do you want me to do with these goals at the end, are you happy with it like that? So thank you very much guys, we'll finish this with a nice little tramp goal that we just managed to pop in, and I will see you guys next time.